Hello, my name is Hiroaki Suzuki, a technology scout based in Tokyo. I'm chemist in education and work for research, development, and marketing of several specialty chemicals in petrol refinery company before joining Evonik. And I have been working for Evonik from the last year, February in 2020. Well, almost at the same moment when I started to work in Evonik, we came across with Corona pandemic, which spread globally. And due to the defensive measure to the critical situation, we had to work at home. That was in the middle of March 2020. So the period I have been in the office of Emonic Japan was only one and a half months, and after that I was almost working at my home. I suppose most of all colleagues in Emonic were in the similar situation, but I was a stranger in Emonic at that time and felt a bit uneasy how to work in alignment with my functions at TechScout. And this is the most memorable moment in Evonik. Now the situation seems to settle down and I feel happy to come back to office again and more than happy to make um, some conversations with my colleagues here. Yeah, um, in the period of teleworking, I was always trying to reach out to colleagues who I haven't met before using Teams meeting. This is, you know, a kind of virtual way of meeting each other, but in the pandemic situation, such communication measure is the most effective way to talk and discuss together. In my role as TechScout, planning something new which can be turned into um, uh, a kind of innovative activities is an important task for me, and I believe such innovative activities cannot be successful without having good communications with other colleagues. Even in the virtual meeting, I kept reaching out to many colleagues, and there were lots of good discussion focusing on specific topics, even those were through virtual meeting. And my next target is to visit some of my colleagues when the pandemic situation settles down and discuss in person to make those colleagues sure that I'm no longer a virtual person. Ivonic, leading beyond chemistry.